What is up guys, today I'm going to show you guys how to fix 60 FPS or Hertz if you have a gaming monitor that, monitor that supports more than what you have on your monitor right now. So for this example today, if we go in settings here, we can see that it's only in 60 Hertz. Today I'm going to show you guys how you can fix that. So let's close this out. So the first thing you want to do is go to your, um, you want to right click on your desktop here and you want to see this thing right here where it says display settings you just want to click that and now it'll bring this up what you want to do is just scroll down like this until you find advanced display and settings it should be right at the end and then all you want to do is click that now what you want to do is click the monitor that you want to show so this is my second monitor right now that it's showing and I want to look at the first monitor so I just click on that and for this example, I already set it just to 60 hertz, which is 60 FPS. And what you want to do is look. If there's more things, like 120, like you can see right here, you and it matches what your display is rated for, then click that, and that should be all you have to do. But like I have a six or a 144 hertz monitor, so this is just not even up to that. So I'm gonna show you guys how you can fix that. So I'll just close this out, and you want to right-click on your desktop. Now, if you have an Nvidia graphics card, you want to hit this. If you have an AMD graphics card, it'll be a little bit different. But you guys should be like able to do the same thing. So right now, I'm gonna show you guys how you do it for an Nvidia. So what you want to do is click the NVIDIA control panel and it'll bring this up. So I'll make this bigger so you guys can see. And right here you can see that there's all these like we saw in the settings menu. But these aren't the 144 hertz like my monitor is rated for. So if you look down here you can see this customize button. You want to click that and then it's going to bring up this. What you want to do is click on create custom resolution so just click that and now it's sh you should look up the resolution in your screen so if you have a 4k monitor you want to look up 4k if you have a 1440p monitor you want to look up 1440p um, resolution and then if you have a 1080p monitor you look up 1080p resolution and 720p resolution if you still have that so just open up your web browser in my case I have a 1080p one so I will look up 1080 1080p resolution and right here in bold it'll say so like mine is like that so if we go back here we can see that it's already selected for me but in your case it might not be so just make sure you just copy these right here so for horizontal pixels you want to put in the first number you see here and for vertical lines right here you just want to put the second number that comes after it so once you have that in here you want to see this refresh rate thing and what you want to do is make sure on the box of your monitor it should say what it's rated for so in my case it's 144 so I put 144 in and that's basically all you have to do I just want to click this test button and it might your monitor will go black for a second I don't know if it's going to in the recording but it's just gonna go black for a second and then it should turn right back on so I'm gonna click it and right now it's turned off and I don't know if it is for you guys but as you can see now it's back here all you want to do is click yes if it doesn't work just leave it and as you can see it went off there again but don't touch anything if it doesn't light back up because otherwise it'll be stuck there so you just wanna if it lights back up and you can like move your mouse around and stuff then you just wanna click that but now once you have this here and you s put in what hurts your monitor is you just wanna click OK and now you want to go to the custom resolution up here and then click apply down here so it should be back on like the 60 hertz like if I'm right here it should as you could see before it looks like that And you just want to go back to custom like this and then it'll say 144 hertz or whatever refresh rate you have 
and then all you want to do is click apply and it'll go, your screen will go black again but now you just want to click yes and now you should be at 144 hertz just to verify that let's close that out right click again and then go to display settings scroll down advanced display settings if we go to the monitor you can see 144 hertz is now an option so guys if you guys did find this helpful and you want to support my channel be sure to like and subscribe and turn on those post notifications by hitting the bell so you'll be notified when i make another helpful video well guys that's going to be the end of the video peace